coming live from Minnesota with the JW Solo USA. So you guys have seen the rebuilds on the computer. We've been doing stage one and stage two. The one just posted, you see how the hard drive was already in and uh, it's already uh, started uploading the software, the hardware and the software um, were on that video and we just up uploaded the software, which is the operating system, Windows 10 Professional 64-bit. So here is a video card uh, I was telling you guys. Here is a video card. Comes with a video card. I think it's going to be here. And these are all the other necessary essentials. So let's check this out and see what we're dealing with here. These are the cables. You can look at it closely. These are the cables. Bring you guys closer a little bit. So these are the HDMI cables. It's a mini HDMI. So the video card I have here is the um, NVIDIA Quadro NVS510. It says a major band is a low profile, is a half height. So this is a two gigabyte NVIDIA, the NVS510 is a PCI Express times 16. So um, it has a chipset of the GPU manufacturer of uh, ATI. It's an ATI. Yes, the chipset is the, um, it says the ATI, according to the specification here from the, uh, the seller. And it has, it works with Windows 10, Windows 8.1, Windows 8, Windows 7 server, um, 2008, 12, 16, 19, and uh, Linux. It said, um, you can, it um, includes for six foot HDMI cables. This is a slim or SFFPC. These are just for the mini PC, this is slim, slim and skinny ones. Uh, it's a NVIDIA NVS510 PCI Express 16. So it has a four channel that uh, you can able to uh, project to um, monitor or TV, UTVs, whatever. It's a two gigabyte. So let's check this out. This is the uh, video card right here. Packed with love from us to you. All right, let's see. It's not about bragging about all these things and let's see what we have. So this is the card here. Never came with the original thing, so but this is what it is. It's a quadro, okay. Here goes the card, and I know a lot of you guys out there know about this stuff. And uh, what do you think? I'm bringing it closer, you can see the details about this, and maybe I can be able to regulate the lighting too. You can have a better shot. What about that? Really detailed, looks fine. So PCI Express, you can see this end goes to the notch on the back of the card where it can hold from when you unplug the card. So this was the one that latches. And it has a little fan here. And uh, look what it is. Okay. And uh, this other side got a chip right here that enter to the other part of the computer. I will show you guys. And this is the slots here. Sorry, I hope you can see that. So it's not a full size card, just like any of the bigger cards. You see how short it is? So I think it's approximately two, um, sorry, about three and a half inch from here. And uh, it's a lot of things, so it has a heat sink underneath here. 
so the fan and all the other stuff whatever uh, uh, connects to make this card really working good and that's what it is so I hope you see uh, what I'm talking about it's a simple build but I can say simple I don't know how to build one of these I give them credit whichever who did so um, so these are the cards it says uh, sorry the cables mini display ports for mini for okay mini display ports to HDMI adapter so let's open up one of these and see how things go from here so you can see at this point so these are just mini ones so you can always unplug this side here just like a HDMI which is a HDMI or whatever it is and goes right there okay plugged so this one when you plug this one this one can go to any uh, HDMI um, any HDMI uh, monitor so I have a Samsung monitors I think it's a 23 inches something like that so I can able to project this on my television well, my 70 inches or my 65 inches television so um, it's just a matter of uh, it's just gonna be a quad um, a quad screen yeah so basically this is how it's gonna be so all those four wires there they're gonna be attached here on this um, out output and this one is gonna sit right on the on the chassis of the, uh, the frame or whatever on the computer and this is how we're gonna um, do that so let's go take a look and see how we can go about this on the